Hey guys, what's going on? This is Mike with 360 Exploration. Thank you for joining our channel today. And I have an unboxing for a new company that is coming out in virtual reality. Their name is New New Low VR. Um, they just put a pledge on, or had their stuff on Kickstarter, and they won, uh, or not won, they raised enough to open up their company. And uh, my business partner and I were in, uh, fortunate enough to get um, the developer kit. Now, I've already sort of opened it. I haven't opened, I haven't taken out a package or anything, but I will show you exactly what I have in here. Start off with, I got a cleaning kit for the lenses. And I got this. Now, this may not look like much. I mean, this is almost like Google Cardboard in my eyes. Um, but what they're coming out with is supposed to be pretty damn big. All right. So a little bit about the company. Um, like I said, they got their start on Kickstarter. Um, it's supposed to be adjustable with user-specific visual circumstances, uh, which will minimize the eye strain so that users can enjoy virtual reality content with more comfortableness. And I guess this will help people that also have glasses so they can watch uh, VR as well. All right, let's get this thing put together. So first thing, I'm gonna open this up. You would think that they have some kind of instruction booklet, but maybe not. Here's the lenses. That's weird. They're kind of, see that little bit of a crookedness there? I guess that's what they're supposed to look like. Oh, there we go. Now I can't see anything out of them. They are blurrier than ever. But that's not the point. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna put these to the side. Now, let's get to the cardboard version and putting it together. Again, like I said, this almost looks like Google Cardboard. But this is their developer kit. This is what they send while waiting. And looks like this is stays there. Hmm. Ah. There we go. Not too hard so far. Here's that. It's got Velcro. Okay. And bring this down just a little bit, guys. All right. So I got. So my first part about the setup of this, I would say is not 
that user friendly. Still having a little bit of issues getting it just perfect. I think it has more to do with that magnet than anything. Right there. Stay. So, not very user friendly to set up. right there. Alright. Now locked in place. But now we should be all situated to download a VR app. Let's down VR. Or VE beat bar. So this isn't my first VR set. This is my first Google, or not Google one, my very first cardboard one, starter set, developer kit. Um, but I have used the Samsung VR with Oculus. Alright. Installing. So it's kind of hard to show you guys, but that's basically what you see. this up and throw this in and all right I guess you just place it right there I hope for the best all right. so the one thing that they do though is you're able to adjust to your set so thing that I would do I would bring that phone up just a hair I can't see crap. Alright, that one's lame. For some reason, my phone is not behaving with VR. So what we're going to do is uninstall that one, and I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is install um, Google Cardboard. You know, you'd think that they came out with something a little bit easier. 
little bit better to use on here too. I'm not finding anything VR. VR apps are nothing worthwhile to um, download. All right. And guys on Twitch, I'm still recording. Thank you for tuning back in. We are fully in business now, so hold down fire photo button for options. Uh, I don't care about shooting stuff at them. I just want to test it. So, let's go on down. Alright. thing I notice my face doesn't fit very well on here like that to me needs to come my way all right so my review after just trying it out is it's all right it does the vr thing that it needs to do where you can move around and everything um and it does a very good job of dividing the screen so you don't have any issues with seeing the half line between uh, the phone now comfort wise the starter kit is not very comfortable and in fact, being on the goggles is even harder. So, again, this is just their starter kit. Their new stuff that's coming out is supposed to be a little bit better, but we will see. Um, I wish, you know, I wish them the best of luck and hopefully it's a lot more comfortable right now I don't feel like I'm close enough for the uh, lenses, so. And then the other thing I would recommend to them is make it to where when I put the phone in here, I don't have to keep fighting it to adjust it. Anyways guys, that is the new new low VR uh, starter VR headset. Um, again, they just took off on Kickstart. Uh, they want, uh, raised enough money to get ready to make their develop or their actual kit. And like I said, this is the starter kit, the developer kit for those that are getting to try it out. Um, it's very not comfortable right now but this isn't going to be the finished product. The finished product is actually going to be a full one with headband and cushion right there and everything like that. And, um, I think the biggest thing that they wanted to show everybody is that these adjust to fit to your liking. But for some reason, where the bridge of my nose is and I'm up here, um, I have this part in my field of view right there. So, um, like I said, thank you for stopping by, um, and new, new low, uh, good startup. Uh, and there's a little bit of work for, especially even with the starter kit. Um, but I wish you guys the best of luck whenever it comes to finishing off the product. So, and I will see you guys later. Peace.